four, three, two, one. There we go. The transition over. Music back on. And we are live. I just need to work out how I'm going to get this to work because for some reason it's disobeying me. Not wanting to play game audio. I'm going to actually have to. How am I going to do this? are going to be doing a new game on Kingdom of Amalur. Re-Reckoning has been remastered of Python. It was remastered for next-gen consoles and like that. I spent literally probably about a thousand hours on this back in the day. I'm gonna have to manually do this in audio. Subtitle. How does subtitles come into audio? Raise brightness up a little bit. And the whole of my piece reminds that. Maybe that's not going to work. Okay, then. Video quality. Well, that like that for now. I am going to restart. Start it. I hope everything will then decide to work. It was good that I started a little bit earlier. There we go. And back in the day, I did play this on console, so me playing this on PC will be a little bit different. Now we can sort stuff out. Hide helmet off. Text language, you have English. Head scaling default. Probably chill out in a moment. Camera's moving, yes. Camera height. Work all that out in a moment. Work it all out as soon as we hop into the game. Let's hop into the game on normal. Even though I used to play on casual because back in the day I was quite casual playing games. From the beginning, we were wrong. And only now, well into the second decade of the conflict, have we begun to understand the mistakes we have made. We lived in harmony among the Fae, in a world awakened to new magic. Perhaps we should have foreseen what might be born. Wait a second. Now it's working. Now it decides to come through the um, wavelength. Amazing tide. What force might awaken? A force. Powerful enough to twist even the eternal and immutable faithful. <laughs> but Gadflo, the new king of the Winter Court, surprised us all. Singular among his people, he was all that other Fey were not. Aggressive, ambitious, visionary. He had power like none we had ever seen. Terrible and deadly. Gadblow and his followers, the Tuatha Deon, believed that a new god was to be born in the east, 
beneath Gadfold's crystalline fortress of Amethyn. In the name of that god, they marched to war against the young races of Amalur. Against a mortal army, no matter the power of their god, we might have been victorious. But the Fae are creatures of magic, not bound by the laws of life and death. Each two that are fallen on the battlefield would soon rise again, for the Fae do not know death as we do. How could we stand against such a force? For ten years the war raged. For ten years the armies of men and Alpha fought and died. But as our numbers dwindled, we knew that it was only a matter of time. Our fate had been written. At least, that is what we believed. Until you died. Wait. Died? Eh, I guess it's a great way to start the game. Do you think this one is that Alpha, Goliath, could even be a Jotun? Always a surprise, eh, Garan? Eyes on the job, boy. Don't matter what it is, dead's dead. And be thankful for that, all we've seen. Go on and pull back the sheet, though. It'll need to be in our report, one way or the other. Oh, customer. Ready. You will be playing as female. So we've got Almain. The Almain are warlike. Oh yeah, warlike and religious nation. A storied origin. Many or many Almain come to the Feyland seeking freedom, or honoring the tradition of their homeland. Racial bonuses: we've got blacksmithing, persuasion, alchemy, and we've got Varani. Hardened by the high seas, the Varani are just as frequently pirates and mercenaries as they are shrewd merchants. They favor swords and daggers as seaworthy weapons. Racial bonuses detect hidden plus one, plus two in lockpicking and mercantile is plus one. I have no idea how you say that name, but they are proud and ancient people from the frozen lands of the north. Judge them they judge themselves fit fine right from wrong under wind, sun and sky, the meta and even handed justice. Alchemy plus one, dispelling plus two, sagecraft plus one. The Dolkafar are renowned as sophisticated students of magic and diplomacy. While they do not shy from conflict, they prefer to resolve disputes subtly and with grace or efficiency. Efficiently in silence to oh, plus one persuasion and sagecraft plus two for stealth. I think that's the, that's the original race I used to go. Yeah, that one's the original race I used to go, but I think for this one, we are going to be going as our main. That will be our race. Okay, so now we get to choose our patron bonuses. God of Fire and Patron of Forge. 
So patron bonuses plus six fire damage, plus five fire, plus six fire resistance. That's if. I don't think we're gonna go down like magic and that sort of stuff. So goddess of wisdom and art plus ten mana. I don't think that's gonna help. By oh, how do you say that god's name? God of war and battle and tactics. Plus five physical damage. Plus five percent armor. Okay, so we have the God of Justice. Oh no, God of Order was the next one. Patron bonus is plus five health and plus five mana. And then you've got God of Justice, which is just plus ten health. I think we are going to go for War. Get the physical. I think we're going to go preset one. I like that one. In turn, I want that about there. I like the kind of like teal sort of coloured eyes there. Realised now with that, I can bring Spotify up. Bring it down at the same time. So we've got eyeshadow. I like that one, I show darkness. Got that lipstick colour. Intensity will about there. Hair. That's all shorter hair. I like that one. My bright colour should be the same. Accessories. Jewelry. Leave back on nothing. Use. There we go, that one. Put it in blue. Right, there we go. I believe that's how I want my character. One of the human women looks our main to me, and in good shape. These our main women, wound tighter than a Barani crossbow. All right then, make sure it goes into the report. You know he'll want all the details. Amazing how well the body held up. Better than I've seen. I'm just glad it's not moving. Must have been born under a lucky star, this one. Anything else we need? Unless you'd like to name her, I think we're done. Put her with the others. I think we're going to go with a name from League Katarina. Character I probably will never play in League. Well, that's it for you then. Better luck next time. Well, I guess that's one way to start a story.
Guessing this is not some sort of sick, cruel afterlife. That's a shield. F. Secrecy. Oh. Experiment disposal. Secrecy is still important in our work. Requires specialization. Specialized disposal of our unfortunate failures. Take that with us. Around here. Ooh. Looking at these controls, where's the... There it is. I want to change sprint. There we go. Rusty sword. Three weapons, primary rusty. Everything seems easier on PC. Why is that? Over here. Stay away. We're gonna have to get over there and save him. Likely. That's how these games begin. Help anybody. You up there, no please time. help me. Please. More mortal scum? No. Yeah, everything's a lot easier on PC. Battered armor. Get you to Professor Hughes right away. He'll have questions for you. Who's Hughes? Professor Formerus Hughes. The Well of Souls is his life's work. The Tuatha are coming into the lower levels. If we hurry, we should be able to beat them to the top. Take these. They'll help keep you safe long enough to get to Hughes. Now let's get going. He'll be in the study on the ground floor of the tower. At least I hope he's there. And safe. Let me get this okay. Let's put that battered armor. Wait, out. Right this way. Uh, you. Born leggings. Old boots. A game like this, we need to do as much exploration as possible. Up. That's just basic lever armor. This is all basic stuff we've been given right now. This is what 
greatest invention, the well of souls. Imagine an end to war, an end to death. And it looks like we just lost well of, well of souls. Boot over here. So we've got to go straight over this way. This game, I was never like the biggest fan of shields, but Wait. do you hear something? You can break me down, but I will. Skill feely kill you. You're going to need more than just that sword. That one had a bow. Get it? How do you know that one had a bow if you haven't been near the guy yet? Secondary. first mate. I want to get all the money and loot that's inside. Leg plate. Anything else worth taking? Take all of those. Good old lock picks. Never gonna see us coming. Got loot for us. Just play. Take out one and then the other will try and kill us. Oh, 
pack. Yes, there's another code. Oh, what's he got? What's he got? What's he got? Money. Better than nothing, I guess. Ink blossoms only respond in the presence of magic. Perhaps there is more. Incredible. What are you? I'm a god. So I'm close to her. Guarding spiders, okay. I think that's everything. That was easy. Bow. Quite a bow. But a mages, but we're not a mage. I'll go back to my long sword. I preferred my longsword. It completely covered the tunnel. Maybe you can use that staff to burn a path through. Maybe. Bones. I guess we'll take everything from that. That's everything that's here. I want to go back to my bow. Oh, and I've got to go back to the staff again. All that. Where is that? It's meant to be gear all around here. Things like I suppose help. these might be able to help if the Tuatha realize what you are. You'll need them. We can't risk you getting killed. Your proof that the well can work. Don't you realize what that means? Just keep going past 
past the top of the well. Hughes will be there in his stopping. I'll see you on the outside. Z money when we leave. I'd prefer to get back to my bow. Quite a stunning game compared to what it used to be. We're saying worth taking. Here we go, I think we're in his office now. I think we found Hughes. One thing, the well of souls, the pursuit of immortality, and you, you're my first success. If we only had the time, there's so much we might learn from one another. Going on. To explain right now, the dwarf have come to stop my work, but I don't believe they know about you. Not yet. What's important is getting you out of there safely. You're the only proof of what we've achieved here. I may not be able to save you. Oh, gosh. I can ensure that it's only success is safe. Uh, where are we? Let's get out of here. I'll stay and fight. Got more questions. Yes, yeah, yeah. You're right. I, I got my notes, but it's most important that you stay safe. It's just that you... You're... Wait, where are you going? astounding. I'm not certain what's caused it, but somehow... Yes, as I was saying, I'm not sure what... Perhaps I should go see. Sir! Sir! Mr. Hughes! The dwarf have reached the lab! That inside the map! We've got to get you out of here now! Quickly! Follow the path to the town of Gore. Find Aga. He's a friend, and he may be able to help you. No matter what else, stay alive! Where did you just get that dagger from? That dagger literally appeared out of nowhere. Any loot in here? I presume not. That went down well. Are you ever gonna win? Most definitely not. Those are the lock picks.
mini boss already. Seventy five percent XP. No loot in here. I think this first one. More than likely that enemies from forty meters away. Look at that. Vocals. That frog me. This is what you really want to see when you just survive an ordeal. One bigger than you, Steve. Destroying all your stuff. New loot. Stuff like this is what we're going to need later. Those are what we're going to need. Definitely need to do something with this. Brian. Hi, I have college actually. That's fine. At least you came in. Okay, 
here. It's all Easy. Gone, plus what I got paid for the information. I don't want any part of this. I'm going home to Odessa. Good news. Anything we can loot, we'll take. Wait a second. Okay, so we can't go over there. And on the map, it shows like this little route we can probably take, but jump. Fight the wolves. There we go. Go this way, Dave. You've come from the tower, haven't you? Name's Agar. Maybe you can help an old faith leader, eh? Let me find you. Poor old Thomas. He respected the way the world works. What a shame. He's probably dead by now. You know about Hughes? He started his experiments here. He asked me if they'd ever be successful. The cards told me that the Well of Souls would work. But its success would come on the day that Hughes was to die. The old man took it pretty well, honestly. Although we did a lot of drinking. I suppose I could spare a little help in memory of Hughes, or in celebration of his success. Whichever. You really don't know much, do you? A fate weaver taps into the threads of fate and channels that energy through a focus. My order prefers cards. The cards are unique to each fate weaver, since we all see the weave differently.
There we go. You, you're the one. Then that means it all makes sense now. The cards this morning. I drew the Grave Digger, the Running Man, and the Beast. Prepare yourself. They're coming. Why is there a guy in the background walking? seen anyone manipulate them like that the fate was changed how the world was supposed to work how did you do that the well calls it may have brought you back to life but that was still part of fate's plan nothing short of a god can do what you did come here i'm going to do a reading you might be able to change the threads but fate will still have a plan for you I promise not to tell you if I see your death. That would be my guess. He was an academic, but he had a proper respect for fate's plan. Unlike most of them. Fine. I'm nervous. Relax. This is what fate we will see. I'll be seeing your place in the pattern of destiny. Who you are, what he's done. Where your path takes you, or at least I should be. You're real, right? I swear I haven't had that much. Can't see my fame. Weave is always hard to see. It's in motion, hard to make out, but undeniable there. Yours is just missing. This doesn't make sense. All mortal creatures have a place in the pattern. You should have one too, dead or not. This is true. And I'm not saying I believe it. That your path is yours to determine. Ooh. I think we go brawler. I think. Yeah, block efficiency and melee damage is higher. I see the threads around you, but they're shifting, changing so rapidly, I can't make sense of them. Normally the threads would guide my hand to the cards, and I'd use those cards to see your pattern in the weave. But it just didn't happen. They wouldn't focus. So either there's something wrong with me, and there isn't, or there's something very wrong with you. It's what does that mean? Nothing. Or it could mean everything. The world is changing. You might be a sign of that. Or maybe the cause. I've never had a reason to doubt my own readings. But we should consult with Arthur. He's not a friend, but he's got a good eye for the tapestry. I'll meet you at his home to the east. I'm going to see if I can be of any help to the wounded at the tower. That's oh, my fame. I don't know if you've got one. That's why we're going to see Arden. He lives in a little hut to the east in Yolden. I'll meet you there. What hey, you yeah, them. I can't see anything worth looting. Probably means there isn't any. 
But that little dwarf guy disappears soon. Certainly don't deserve this. I'm damn. Here she was attacked with some manner of short blade, likely a dagger, but there's no way I can be sure. People simply stood by as she called for help. No one lifted a finger. Can you imagine? It's shameful to treat another in such a way, even if she is a fae. I don't know whether we possess the knowledge to treat such a wound. Frankly, I don't even know if I could save a mortal with such grievous wounds. Out. Well, you're the only one. With all the troubles we've suffered in this village, people are weary of adversity. They'd rather just ignore it. I'm going to suggest something a bit untraditional. There's a fae named Derry. She spends her days up in the hill overlooking the village. Seek her wisdom. I would do it, but I'm a coward. That's the truth. Perhaps a fae will know how to heal a fae. If not, we are back where we started. She spends her days in the precipice overlooking the village. She doesn't think we're aware of her presence, but we most certainly are. Bye okay. Now. This black. This is the blacksmith, I think. Doesn't say. Blacksmiths. Gauntlets. And we'll leave that for the moment. Are you here for a weapon? Going to earn a lord's favor? Um, ridiculous war, are you? to sell things. You haven't taken anything? She can see me. Both their visions to go down with me. No, don't you come over here. But just please, me, please leave. Please go back in the other room. Waiting for you. Where, where are you going? Go away! Fine, sir. Good, this thing's going down. I should be able to take the stuff in this chest in a moment. Hey! 
There we go. Rep, good. Helped. Hey, Tenchi. Great. I may or may not have stolen some things. No. That one. No. Uh, skills, there it is. Which is stealing? Oh, I was just stealing some stuff from um, that chest. But because there's three different, there's three people around who could see me, I had to wait for them to be out of, or at least not looking in my direction. Don't look at me, please. Don't look at me. There we go. pick lock on this one. No, don't come over. Don't come over. Don't come over here. Kind woman, please leave. <laughs> don't come over here. No. What are you doing? Now not looking at me. Is that going to go down? Please go down. Guess we can't go for this chest then. But according to the map, top corner, there's some chests upstairs. Well, armor, peasants' clothes, more peasants' clothes, merchants' cap. That done. Welcome. Please, madam, please may you move. Just so I can open this chest and take your things. This is your cue to move, to move, please. She's not gonna move again, is she? An easy chest to open. I can't do it with her standing there. I don't want to be that guy who goes around killing random citizens. With her being a merchant, don't want to be killing her. Come on. Please move. Ooh. I'm not in her sight at the moment. But we'll just wait for that to go down and then I can open the chest. Now stay still. easy. XP for it. Go back into Go Heart. And there's another merchant in the area as well. Not just this blacksmith thing. Yes, just here. Test. Special deliveries. Take all of that, please.
Wait, let's have a look at all that stuff we just picked up. My chest. Weapons, any swords? Yes, the beast. That's my second direct. Bunt. Armor. That's free might and health. That's better. Wait, lock. Ooh. No, I think Shepherd's is best. What I want. That gives me 10% health, blocks 7 damage, crit of melee, physical damage, mana, damage from magic. I'm gonna get that one. Realize right now. Overcumbered. I now can't carry any other items. I need to level up. When I level up, where is it? Status, skills. If I can get into this... Salvage rare items... I get to three more levels I need. Let's go find the mission, carry on with the mission, main mission. Probably get some XP and everything from this. Red Legion Archer. Oh yeah. I'll take that Red Legion Archer. One type of weapon I do love is this weapon. Just because of the fact that it's kind of ranged and at the same time it's not. Physical. Oh yeah, we can't carry anything. That. country of Nirilim's embrace, the summer manifests as an immortal thing. You know her, him, it, as the... Ugh, finally. Someone that looks like they could stand up to a moderate breeze. There's need for an adventurer such as yourself. Me and a crew are mounting an expedition to a new land south of here. Expedition. Never end strong, I see. It's as I said. We're going to the teeth of Naros, the land south of Dalintar. If you want more information, see Kellett Cross. He's leading us. We're camped beyond Etnir. Enough okay. of Windy where I am. I wouldn't know if it's windy where I am, but 
For me, I'm in. I haven't been outside today. Professor Fat. This guy's crazy. I help you. No mission we can come back to. Let's go meet. I can't even think what his name is. Oh, no mission we can pick up. Rich in law. I heard snippets of a ballad and a beautiful ruby ring. I need someone to help me get it. I do it. Ballad is called ring and it means I can get XP and money. Little about it, but if we reenact the ballad step by step, the ring should come to us. In the story, a maiden asks a champion to reclaim a ring stolen by a troll. A few years too late, but I'll play the role of the maiden. <laughs> you be the champion. First, you must prove your prowess by hunting wild antelope. Bring back something to lure the troll. Good luck. Be able to ask that question. Let's carry on heading to our normal mission. This way. Keep That's just literally just here. Arden's hat. Let's see Arden then. Let's see if he knows more about our fate. Wait. Please don't say it's Arden. Killed Arden. Oh, is that the name of this fate weaver? No, the Tuatha I was following killed him. I was hoping his corpse would give me an idea of why they were here. Now I know. They were hoping to find you. Why is she mum involved? You're definitely involved. But something tells me I know you better than you know yourself. 
How would you name him? Ref killed him. Why would they have come here? Why kill a harmless old faithful? They couldn't know that you were held here. I mean, the stingy bastard owes me a week of drinks. Doesn't mean he deserves to be hurt. I was hoping you were going to But I think I'm going to have to take you to the It's a sacred place to leave faithful. Somewhere that I was hoping to. I was hoping Arden could take it, but I guess it comes down to me. No reason getting anyone else killed over it. Go, I'll meet you there. Once I give Arden a proper funeral. It is twice now I've buried the bodies left in your way. I can't even take anything. No matter how much I want to. Delark is this way. I think for a moment. Switch to that one for a moment. Kill four and boat. One more. Oh, it's a crate. Yes, the hard one. Kami. One more antelope. Question is where is this last last antelope we're gonna kill? Him doesn't exactly tell us. I was looking the whole time. Really? You were looking the whole time. Right, I haven't been talking to no one other than Tenshi, Valkos and Utkash the whole time. Yes, I haven't been alone in this journey. Oh, where is this lo- There's an antelope. And that looks more like a deer. There we go, now we can return to Henry. Hit the Witcher. Ooh, what do you think of the Witcher?
Which one? Was that the whip? Good. Three? Third one, that's you need to mount the trophy. Which are the wild hunters, isn't it? When all are displayed, Lekka should come. Once he's there, it should be easy business claiming the ring. I mean you've killed a troll before, right? I never played the first one. I played the second one for a little bit. I played the third one quite a little bit as well. But I never finished them. The antelope heads on pedestals. Oh. Ah, oh, damn it, he's resisting. See, originally when I played this game, I played it on Xbox 360. So for me, the controls are completely different. I gotta clean my room and stuff. Can't leave it as it is when I move out. Very true. Saying about my room, I've got like area for food there, bottles and everything all over the floor there. I need to tidy up later. Probably do that while I'm watching Ben later. I'll level up. You are still here, Tenchi. That. Death grants you a surge of health. No, I don't want that. I'm trying to think of the skills I had back when I played on Xbox. Run into that. Smash the ground and cause a tremor. Damaging enemies. Yes. Stick with. Wait. Okay, so we can't do any more other than those three yet. Wait, I want to have a check. Just a second. It's four opponents when crafting weapon, crafting equipment, increases the effectiveness of packets. So from here, I want to go quests. I want to go. Good sprites well. Just killed them so we can now return to the guy. Oh, sprites are after us. Sprites look adorable, but you don't want to you want to kill you have to kill them. It's just not fair. Just rusty sword. No, we're gonna any loot we're gonna have to leave behind. Annoyingly. Do you come 
to me empty handed. What is the meaning of this? Well vanished. Two-leg kind might <laughs> call it the well that wanders. Throughout the forest, it would vanish and reappear like a wolf on hunt. But what prey it seeks. Before I was cursed, I remember <laughs> strongly atop the water was the scent of leech wood. Perhaps the well seeks that. I can find leech wood. That is the two leg name for that wood that feasts on strength. It appears through the glass. Forest. Should not be hard to find. The sense of the well was strong. Okay, fate meter. Remember, my fate meter is full. Cover the well's waters. So the well is over here. From the looks of it. No chance. Oh, it's moved again. It keeps moving. Wish it would stop moving. Very strong. Thank you, the Rain Daggers. A bit moving well. <laughs> oh, what's that? It was right there. There. Don't move well, don't move. Moved. Ha. I think it's on a timer before it moves. Spelling on this, we're going to learn how to dispel. There we go. That's locked by a key. We wait here. Well, should appear or not?
What's it say in the quests? Cover the whale's water. Our precious leech would bark and must bring. Now bring it. Well. First, however, I must catch the well. Well, is now over here. Wait here a moment. There we go. Come on, come on. Yes. There we go. Did it. Let's go the XP from helping this guy. That's cool. He was actually a wolf. He didn't try and trick us. I'm actually going to end here for now. If people are watching and they haven't already, they can drop a follow down below. But I will be live again in five hours. But for now, thanks for watching. See you all next time. But before I actually end, I'm gonna quickly raid someone. Marzipan or anything. I want to bring history up quickly. I will see you guys on the other side.